Hey everybody, so yesterday I was talking to a client, a one-on-one -on -one client, and he told me that he had lost a ton of weight when he went on a vegan diet. Uh, per the advice of high carb health, um, healing, self-healing, Crohn's and colitis, the Dr. Klein diet. So when we are trying to get better, we don't want to take advice from skeletons and people who died at the age of 50. Dr. Klein died at a very young age uh, due to like a cold, something very minor. And the only reason he passed away is because he was super malnourished because he followed a vegan diet uh, the, the vast majority of his life. You can get better following a vegan diet, but it is going to be very difficult. One, because it's difficult to follow the diet because it's so tasteless and bland. Another reason, because it's so expensive. And then the most important reason is because it's so devoid of protein. And the vegan diet version that this program has you follow is extremely devoid of nutrients because all they have you eat is potatoes and bananas and like fruit juices. It's, it's totally whack job bullshit. It's like, it makes me so angry. This diet makes me so angry because so many people are misled by it. And I see so many people get injured following this diet because when your body is going through this process, so what's, they don't even understand the process. Not No one understands the process, but what is really happening, and we know this through the knowledge of German New Medicine, is everybody with Crohn's or colitis, they're gonna have a ring in their brain, in their brainstem, 100% of the time in the same exact location. It was caused by a conflict shock, a stressful event that caught you off guard that you could not digest. Maybe it was a breakup, maybe it was buying or selling a house, that's always fun. Maybe it was some family drama, school drama, or work drama, it usually falls under one of those categories. Your body developed extra gut cells to help you digest this hard to digest thing in your life. You resolved it on some level, the body started getting rid of these extra gut cells and that is when your symptoms started. That's when the diarrhea starts. That's when the blood starts. That's when the mucus starts flying out of your butt when you resolve that conflict. I know it's not, doesn't sound smart, and it doesn't seem like it helps you. I, I, in German New Medicine, we call it significant biological special programs. I call them biological stupid programs because they really don't help organisms get through the conflict. But that's the design we are stuck with and that is what is truly happening in the body. And when the body is going through that process of creating extra gut cells and removing these extra gut cells, your body is burning through protein and the vegan diet has very low protein in it. The only way you can get adequate amounts of protein into your diet on the vegan diet is with uh, beans, legumes, that they are the most uh, protein rich plant foods, but most importantly, I think the vegans need to start using their brains and they need to start eating eggs. Eggs are cruelty free. Eggs get laid and they do not turn into a chicken unless they're fertilized and most eggs aren't fertilized. And also dairy, family, family farm, dairy farms, those cows are spoiled rotten. They are treated better than most pets at home. So you can consume uh, dairy and you can consume eggs and be guilt-free about the whole thing because you're not killing anything. But guess what? When you make your plants, when your plants get farmed and stuff, that the, the machinery to harvest those plants, it's like raking through the ground and killing prairie dogs and killing birds and killing snakes and all sorts of things. So you're still killing animals eating your food. So either way, you're, not, you're gonna have to kill something. But, you know, eggs and dairy, if you're gonna go the vegan, the vegetarian way, which is the hard way, uh, you need extra protein and those are your two uh, sources of protein. So the only way you can get better is if you fully come to peace with this indigestible thing in your life. I can help you do that on a one-on-one -on -one session. Uh, it takes some time to get to know you, to find your conflict and find how it's still haunting you today and help you understand what's going on in your body, help you understand what's going on with your symptoms. So go down in the, call, in the description below and sign up for a free strategy session. And you wanna do this because I have tried everything and I am the only one, I, it, it hurts me to say this, but I am the only one who gets to the root cause.